Well, Thomas Road remains closed near Plank Road after a crash and train derailment this morning. Our Courtney Williams is live there on the scene and Courtney, we see some of that heavy equipment moving in behind you. I only imagine crews are working right now to upright that derailed train. Good morning to you. Yeah, good morning to you guys. Well, this again, Darren, this has been going on and as you just saw those uh, trucks with the heavy machinery just came through here on Thomas Road. Uh, officials been out here. This is around 5, 545. That's when they got the call about this accident that happened and I actually got a chance to speak with railroad officials and they told me that the train was on the tracks on here on Thomas Road and that's when uh, 18 wheeler hit the train at full speed, but luckily the driver was able to get out and was not transported to the hospital. The conductor wasn't injured, but again, there were just some minor injuries, but no one was transported to the hospital. So uh, the conductor and the driver of the 18 wheeler is expected to be okay. But uh, if anyone drives here on Thomas Road near Stoop Corporation, it is still blocked off by the sheriff's department. So they're just rerouting uh, anyone who uh, comes on this road. So it's been a few hours, but I'm sure there's still uh, more uh, they have to do officials to clean up that area because there was one uh, train car that was derailed and another one halfway. So it's still a process to go, but as we get any more information, we'll be sure to bring that to you on air, online, and also on our free VR Proud app. Reporting live in Baton Rouge, Courtney Williams, Fox 44 News.